today we're going to talk about creating a submittal package in Bluebeam. So we're going to start with a standard submittal transmittal, which we've created in Prolog and saved to a PDF or exported to a PDF. Okay, see it's just a simple two page. Okay, just change my view there so I can see everything all at once. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my document, pages, insert pages. And what I've done is I've actually opened my actual submittal data that I've gotten from my subcontractor already. So I can use the add files or I can use the add open files. I'm going to show you both ways. So the first thing is I'm going to do add open files. And what that will do is basically every file that's open other than the one that you have will automatically be added to the list. You can order them. Okay, or we can just use the add button. And then we can select from our files the two files that we need to add in. In this case, the shop drawings and the MSDS data. Okay, we want to include any file attachments and we want to merge the layers. We're going to place this after the last page because we don't want it to be inserted in between the two pages of the transmittal. Okay, then we'll just verify our order and go ahead and click OK. And within a few seconds, we have one complete document. As you see here, I'll scroll up and down and use the page button. We've got all of our shop drawings with all of our markups on it. Okay. Go a little bit further down, you'll notice the technical data and technical specifications are included, the NOA data. Okay. And the pages are inserted in the same manner that they were in the original document. Okay. If I go back to the beginning, you'll notice that my transmittal is right on the top. And any bookmarks that were created in those other two files are kept alive. So I can jump from page to page. Notice if I hit the uh, submittal data, I've got that. And all my NOAs and the different files that were included in my product data. So now the last step here is to go ahead and save our document as our new name. So it's just simple, save as. Uh, I'm going to rename it, use the storefront as a base. Okay. I'm going to take the date off. Just so that it has our standard naming convention. Okay, project, submittal number, and then submittal title. Then go ahead and save that. And now we have a completed package of all of our submittal documents in one PDF. I can go ahead and close those other two. Okay. And now I can send this to someone or I can go ahead and uh, upload it to our studio, which I'll show you guys in a, another video. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed this lesson, and come back to Styles University for more lessons on how to use Bluebeam.